Hello, my name is Tabitha. Welcome to my channel. It's my first channel ever and my daughter who's 10 had to show me how to even do it. So that's awesome. Um, what I'm doing though is showing my journey. Uh, I started Isogenics about two and a half weeks ago. So far I've lost about 13 pounds. That was the last time I weighed which was um, with, I weighed at the end of the first week, and that's how much I had done. I started at 200 and, 218 and got down to 205, lost five and three quarters inches. When they send you this little doohickey, you can record your measurements on there. It has everything from your bust to waist, your hips and your legs and all that stuff. So I, I'm starting this video blog, as my daughter calls it, a vlog whatever. Um, not for you necessarily, but it's more for me so I can see my journey from the beginning to the end so that when I get there to my goal, which is um, just to be healthy, then I will be able to see the difference in a real tangible way so that I don't go backwards. So I just finished a workout. It was, um, it was like uh, I'm, well, I'm training for a half marathon, which I've already done a couple, but I took a good year and a half off, and I was one of the bigger runners. I was uh, still 220 pounds trying to run a half marathon. It took me over five hours to complete it. So if you imagine that's driving from, like, let's say Spokane to Seattle, it's a five-hour drive. I was running and walking that entire time, so... Just to give you an idea, I um, like, like, I don't, I don't lack drive. I don't lack discipline. So it's always been kind of, for like, okay, really frustrating for me that I haven't been able to find a way to lose the weight. Um, I, I, I don't know. I've tried a lot of things, and a, a lot of people say that on videos. So, um, but I have. I've tried a lot of things, and I push really hard. Um, and I have yet to find the thing that works the best for me. I even went vegan again. Like I went for about a year and a half. No dairy, no meat. Um, ate a lot of fruits and vegetables. I dropped about 20 pounds right away. And then it all uh, came rolling back. Um, so I'm hoping that doing this will keep me on track. And it will keep me honest. Um, because when I, when I'm looking at the camera and this is what I see, it makes me, um, it makes me rethink quitting for one. Um, I think the biggest difference for me this time around too is that I've, um, I've kind of gone through some counseling and dealing with some things from childhood and I'm finally getting to the point where I actually love myself more than I ever have before. And that's saying a lot. I didn't love myself before, and so I didn't give myself a chance to be healthy. I figured I didn't deserve it. So, um, yeah. So I'm trying isogenics. I'm going to show you. I'm going to stand up so I can see day one. Of, well, not really day one. But hey, there's my daughter. What's Hi. up, Sierra? Say hello. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay, standing up now. Okay. There's the back. Side. And this is after already losing 13 pounds or so, and this is still where I'm at. So, here we go. There's my dog. Okay, closer up. Not the best angle, anyway, but... Anyway. So, you get the idea. Um, if anyone actually does watch this, then, I don't know, thanks. Maybe give me some encouragement down below, because I'm sure I'm not the only one that's been here. Um, <laughs> I really hope that this is going to change things for me, and that I'll actually have a chance to to prove that I can make changes in my life um, a step at a time. Right now I'm having this. This is a, one of their Isoline shakes. It's a berry flavored one, which does not have dairy in it. 
yeah, dairy and lactose free. It's 22 grams of plant based protein, so it still supports my veganness. But um, it has all kinds of stuff in here. Here's the back of it in case you want to look. Ma. Let's see, focus, buddy. Get in there. It's not going to let me focus. Mmm. Anyway, okay, well, whatever. Just buy it, it's good. Um, when you order it, you get this cool shaker thing with Jig. Um, I used uh, a packet of that. I put water in it first, just about to like this level, and then I pour the packet in and then shake it. And then I add extra water up to here. Uh, because if you do it in the wrong order, then it kind of gets clumpy. So this is my way to fix that. So anyway, um, cool. We'll see you next time. Thanks for listening. Bye.